Just waking up in the morning, gotta thank God. I don't know, but today seems kinda odd. No barking from the dog, no smoke. And mama cooked the breakfast with no hog. I got my grub on, but didn't dig out. Finally got a call from a girl I wanna dig out. Hooked it up for later as I hit the dope. Thinking, will I live another 24? I gotta go, cause I got me a drop top. And if I hit the switch, I can make the ass drop. Had to stop at a red light. Looking in my mirror, not a jacker in sight. And everything is all right. I got a beat from Kim, and she could do it all night. Called up the homies, and I'm asking y'all, which part are y'all playing basketball? Get me on the court, and I'm troubled. Last week, messed around and got a triple double. Freaking brothers every way, like MJ. I can't believe today was a good day. From the cowards, cause just yesterday them fools tried to blast me. Saw the police and they roll right past me. No flexing, didn't even look in a brother's direction as I ran the intersection. Went to show dog's house, they was watching your MTV raps. What's the haps on the craps? Shake them up, shake them up, shake them up, shake them. Roll them in a circle of homies and watch me break them with a 7. 7 11, 7 11, 7 even back those little Joe. I picked up the cash flow, then we played bones, and I'm yelling domino, plus nobody I know got killed in South Central LA, today was a good day, a good day, a good day, a good day, I can't believe today was a good day, a good day, a good day. Left my homie's house pay. Picked up a girl, been trying to dig since the 12th grade. It's ironic, I had the boo, she had the chronic. The Lakers beat the super sign. Felt on the big fat fanny. Pulled out the jammy and killed the big nanny. And now the jimmy runs deep, so deep, so deep. Put her butt to sleep. Woke her up around one, she didn't hesitate to call Ice Cube for Top Gun. Go <laughs> to the pad and I'm coasting. Took another sip of the potion, hit the three wheel motion. I was glad everything had worked out. Dropped a burnt off and then choked out. Today was like one of those fly dreams. Didn't even see a berry flash in those high beams. No helicopter looking for the murder. Two in the morning got the fat burger. Even saw the lights of the good year blue. And it red ice cubes up again. We moving quick today. Oh, no shit. Up halfway home and my page is still blowing up. Today I didn't even have to use my AK. I gotta say it was a good day. That's right, we're here today. On this Wednesday. Wednesday.
Alright, get yourself ready, boys. Get it, get it ready. Get it ready. Get everything. Comments, thoughts, concerns. Because there will be no tier three today. Just me and you, motherfuckers. Just me and you. Over the place. Check. Uh, yes. Shit. Mm. So, actually, hold on. Let me see. What's the cycle again? One Piece games? Let me see. What do I go? Let me go to Twitter real quick. Oh, that's cool. But I need to go to. Okay, here we are. Here we are. It, right? This is it? This is it? Uh, yeah, yeah. This is the place. Where the true DJs meet up. Alright, man. Let's go, let's go, let's go. TCB drop too? Oh, hold on. Time out. Huh, low. I thought it was just going to be... Oh, they did. Oh. Oh, oh shit. The chapter house sent Omaru. Okay. All right. All right, never mind. All right. We're not going to be the DJ area. We're going to be the TCB Golden Boys. Um. Yeah, okay. Yeah, fair enough. Because the re I actually assumed that it was going to be One Piece scans because, well, it's pretty obvious. I'm doing this on Wednesday, not on Friday. But then again, to be fair, I guess because of what happened... And the break, they would come out earlier on TCB as a result. I think TCB wants to lose out to, uh, ooh, much love. Yeah, all the donos, all the stuff, all the donos, all the stuff, let me know. Let me know. Um, because today we will not be having um, any stuff involving the... What is, what, is what, is what is it? 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 Uh, I'm thinking. Oh, fuck. I blanked out. Holy shit. Wait. Time out. Yeah. Right. Tier three. There is no tier three. There is no tier three. Um, Obviously, because we have Amitai tonight. Okay. So let me just focus on. Let me just focus on the. Let me just focus on the. Let me just focus on. All right. Let me make sure we got uh, everything situated properly. Okay, we're good. Uh, Darth. Oh, what the hell? Oh, thank you, Julius. I don't know what's going on there. Appreciate it. <clears throat> so, the <clears throat> we have no tier three because I'm tired. I'm, I'm tired. I'm today. I'm tired. So you got a groggy king. We have no tier three today because we're going to have probably a stream on Friday talking about not only this chapter on Peace, but also the One Piece live action. One Piece live action drops tomorrow. That's why I'm doing this stream for One Piece number 1091 today. Um, and then I'm gonna do that on Patreon. I, and I, I'm assuming, I, I'm assuming that we're gonna be doing this in bulk for the One Piece live action. Cause normally that's how they do in Netflix. There are some, like I remember in, um, I remember for JoJo's parts, ooh, for JoJo's part six, they didn't do everything in bulk. So there's a good chance here. I think, I think, yeah. So I'm, uh, those are something else too. I want to say with Isekai Oji-san, 
Yeah, Isuke G san I well, you know, maybe... I forget, because I know they had production issues. But the idea is that they may not do it in bulk um, for the uh, one episode out tomorrow. And if, then, if they don't, then we'll watch episodes one and two and whatever they have available. But if they do do everything in bulk, so like all, like all, all like eight episodes, they're gonna, we're going we're gonna to roll through the shit. Will I watch everything one day? I, I don't know. Because y'all know me. I'm a pause fucking wizard. But I'm gonna roll through everything as much as I can on Thursday because uh, I'm gonna try and focus more so on uh, speed yeah, um, for the next few months and see how things go. Okay. All a big boy. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, I plan on streaming. I want to say around six o'clock in the afternoon on Patreon. I may do earlier. But that being said, that's the reason why we're not doing two thirty tonight. Cause what's well. That's the reason why we're doing the stream today, not tomorrow, A. And then B is that we're going to do the usual anime tonight, tonight on Patreon. Uh, once again, it's a lot of Baki sh- Baki on my And of course, the usual anime you watch every Wednesday and every Saturday night. Um, so, no, we're not, we're not doing 24-hour stream, baby. No, mm -mm. no, not, no, not on Patreon. No, I will actively, no, I, no, I can't. I can't, I can't, because you know what's going to happen? In the corner, you have Vimeo lurking. Like, <laughs> mm, this fat boy right here doing what now? 24, yeah, you going to pull up? Yeah, I'm like, oh, these motherfuckers are crazy. So, uh, <laughs> That's why I can't do it. Oh, they would, yeah, yeah, like yo, huh, you gotta, you gotta fuck over, fuck over another grand there, son. Like, oh yeah, so I'm good, I'm good. Uh, they already have enough, and I'm taking more as it is. But that being said, um, we're gonna do that. Probably, I want to let's say eight episodes. I'll do four, probably tomorrow, and then we'll see where things go from there. Okay, uh, pause, rewind, fast forward, uh, all that fun stuff. So we'll see. With that being said, you guys know the drill. We're going to be doing MA, or we're going to be doing the chapter today. And then, so give me all your thoughts, comments, concerns. Give, give me all that shit. All that shit. All that shit. And then we'll just go from there. So, let me get to my prayers. I did change the camera up a little bit. It's a little bit higher, which I think is fine. Um, I want to make sure that the camera is situated more properly so you can get more of the background and the ambiance. And of course, as you can see, one of the greatest entities to ever exist in anime and manga history right above me. All oh, these bars, they flow. Don't stop me. Because <laughs> it can't stop Katakuri. Yeah. Baby. It feels like it's low. Why is it low? This is low. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Just in time, Ju. That's in time, Juan. That's in time, baby. That's right. Correct the mundo. You made it. We made it. On this rare Wednesday stream for One Piece chapter reaction content. Of course, whenever we do this One Piece chapter action content. We have to bask ourselves first and foremost under the guidance, under the greatness, under the majesty of one of the greatest to ever do it. His name will forever be remembered.
I'm in the wrong fucking profession, dude. <laughs> I feel like I should actually be a pastor, unironically. All right. But having said, it's fine. Doesn't matter. We're here. We're here. So safe. The Lord. God of We are here today on this fine Wednesday. Okay. Now, if you're wondering why I didn't get any donos off the rip, it's because I'm going to do all that stuff after the chapter is done. So, donations, subscriptions. I'll go to the chapter immediately because I'll make sure I know how long the, the, the reaction is going to be. Uh, that's just why I'm going to prayers immediately. And then from there, we just do what we got to do. And so I can go to Amy tonight after eat some food. Okay? So, Luffy dies well. Uh, though there should be a certain admiral. <laughs> if he gazes the monk of Jesus. Uh-oh. What, what, what? We're jumping the gun here. Because first, we have to say our gratitude, our respect, to the mama. The second son. And the holy. Yeah. Donuts. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> bing, 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 bing. <laughs> ah. ah. Man. A and E. Oh, no. Lot. And now, you have to show, yes, Kakuri over King Lafar, correct. And now, you have to show respects. To a man, a myth, a legendary creature who shook the very annals of shonen, nay, anime and manga history itself. Voice acted by the late and great Kin Ryu Arimoto, currently by Ryuzaboro Otomo. With the mighty girl ushering in a second pirate surge, only second to Gold D. Roger himself across the One Piece world. Even the great Toji had to pay respects in his final moments to the great Oivira. Because ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, what is up, what is good? The King U of Lightning here today, bringing you guys and gals, One Piece. The One Piece Wall, chapter 10, 9 1 on Wednesday, live hump day, live stream, live, 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 reaction. Oh, shit. Also, real quick, too, on the main channel, we're going to switch things up again. And I, cause I want to focus more on topic videos. So, we're going to be doing just one video for the chapter rather than two. Not a review and first take. We're just going to do one video, see how that plays out. Like a general video on the chapter and see how that then. So we'll see how things go, okay? The thing is that this probably will lead to faster content for the chapter. All right, so. Shanks, much love for the Twitch Prime, 32 months. Uh, Kurt Birdwell, 11 months. Uh, again, I'm going to all, so again, all thoughts, comments, concerns. Donos, whatever. I'm going to get to that after this chapter. We'll see how it goes, right? We'll see how Sentomaru is able to split the sky with Kizaru. Oh, what, Nani? They're not even touching. <laughs> oh, shit. Bro. Sentomaru eking his way in, sliding his way in to the top 30, yo. <laughs> By the way, there have been some consideration. I'm not trolling when I say this. 
Though I kind of am, because it's going to be so dumb. It's going to be so fucking mind-renderingly stupid. Like, why the fuck would these goddamn R-words, meaning me, do this? I am considering... <sighs> fuck. The Fable Top 50. <sighs> now, <clears throat> it's a really dumb idea. A really fucking stupid idea bro that would be like a goddamn 48 hour conference of just actual idiots do it listen i don't know man top 30 is one thing top 50 yeah i know you're here but you listen listen to, to twilight welcome to the family don't get so conceited yeah. sir. the problem is that niggas talk a big game but when they step on the court they get fucking dunked on right you th there was one streamer um recently i remember seeing like on dexterdo he tried to do some weird like 72 hour enclosed room bullshit where like he had ping pong balls being thrown at him he had some uh like water dunked on him he was in a closet and he, he was gonna stay for like 32 hours or some bullshit like that nigga lost he couldn't mentally cope with that he could not mentally cope with that Happened recently. Guess what? I don't know if I can cope mentally with a top 50. Because the first 10 fucking niggas are going to be so goddamn controversial. Like, why the fuck do you have Jack the Drought over Dofa Ming? Like, oh, shit. Like, we're going to do full-on breaks, yo. We're gonna do like full on, like, okay, it's time for a nap break, all right? We're gonna take a break for like three hours. So it's nap break, nap break, all right? We'll come back in like three hours, niggas. Shit, all right? Goddamn. Either way, so. <laughs> um, well, it'll be a two part on YouTube, probably, because I can't fit everything all into like one stream on um, YouTube. Maybe even a three part, potentially. But over on Twitch, it could be like just whatever, dude. Wait, what's the max time you do for Twitch stream? Like, is it actually like 72 hours or something? Like for the VOD to save? I don't know. You know, I need to start, you know what? I need to start like paywalling shit. I need to start paywalling my streams across the board everywhere. Oh my God. It's gonna be kind of, oh. okay. Either way. Um, and also we're gonna start doing more read throughs. I'm gonna start after I get the Build King, I'm gonna start getting to the read throughs for certain series, my hero manga. My Hero, I think JJK, Webtoon stuff is coming out real soon too. All right, either way, so. But I've been trying to attack on, I need to get paid. Wait, hold, oh yeah, shit, okay. All right, all right, hold on. I need to, I need to, I need to introduce it, all right, uh, fuck me. Fuck me, okay. What's, what, what, what's the fucking uh, threshold here? Um, no, no, hold on, wait, hold on, fuck me. Okay. Uh, announcement. Okay. Fucking. Uh, do I have any sound? I don't, I don't know how many. Fuck. I don't have any sound effects. I don't have a fucking soundboard. Okay. Doesn't matter. Announcement. 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 Everyone, saddle up. Everyone, listen up. Announcement. 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 Okay. Announcement. No, not gaming. But we'll get that soon enough. I promise you. Here's the announcement. I have decided. Since people do want this. I will read Attack on Titan, and I will read even Boruto. I will read them. However, on Twitch.tv, you have to drop 40 gifted subs per chapter. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's what it is. 40 gifted subs per chapter. And 
if you want to do it on YouTube, because I don't have any alerts on you. I'm not, you do they do you get the thumbs on YouTube? I I need to set my YouTube shit more probably. Whatever. We'll we'll, we'll 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 get to that soon. That will be two fat stacks, two Arabian nights on YouTube. I believe so. Wait, is that how the commercial? No, wait. I'm sorry. I'm getting it wrong. Fifty. Whoa. Take it back. I'm getting it wrong. Fifty. Fit. I said, hold on. Shit. 50, I'm sorry, 50 gifted subs on Twitch, 200 fact stacks over on the tube, boom, okay, so, I will, I will do it, everything has a price, that's a price, we like Borto that much, hey, I'll bet, we'll see, all right, I'll, I'll put like an alert or something like that in the corner, I have no idea, all right, because I want to do more read through stuff now that Black Clover is coming out like what every like ever every other decade, and you have <laughs> and then regular Ragnarok we went for the fights to complete anyway, um and then One Punch is One Punch Man. All right, so that being said, let me da -da 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 -da. okay oh shit fuck me uh with no lube oh okay so let's see how good this chapter is for today Sento Maru. Okay. Hey, yo, huh? Appreciate you from Germany. Got you. Yeah, I'm reading JJK, but I'm going to read the content that I haven't watched in the anime or the anime hasn't gotten to yet. So my idea is to read my hero because I'm still anime only, but I don't mind reading the chapter content, the chapter version of what I already watched. So that's all I'll do for JJK, my hero, in the near future. Where, okay, I watched the hidden inventory arc in JJK, good arc. So I'm going to now read that in the manga and see how it compares to the anime version. That's what I plan on doing. Okay, so let's get into this. Let's get into this. Tower of God, I dropped Tower of God, dude. I have to get all the, like, the dog shit. I was like, yo, what the fuck is going on, man? I, 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 don't, I don't even know anymore. I don't even know. Oh, uh, Vic LaFlair, appreciate it for the five. The dog. Again, I'm going to do everything now, but appreciate it for the five bucks we're on the tube. It means a lot. What about that? Bless your heart. I know, Wednesday, I know things are off. I know, I know. All right, so on that note, oh, uh, we have Monkey D. We have Monkey D. Luffy <laughs> and Rob Lucci. <laughs> is that Rob Lucci actually, or is that? Hold on. Wait, is that an actual unironic leopard or cheetah? Usopp is riding Chopper because we need to have God King Usopp have a mount. True. And I, nah, actually, that's, I don't think that's Rob Lucci. No, that's just a fucking, that's just a random cat. <laughs> All right, bet, bet. Okay, that's a random cat. That's a random cat. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, no, no notes from Oda. I'm surprised. Okay, let me see. Uh, oh, there's actually, a, damn, so they have the front cover magazine. Uh, okay. Didn't they have the one last time too? Am I going crazy? Or was that JJK? Damn. And then there is another one. Um, we have the entire track eating fucking pizza. So you have Jinbei and Sanji cooking. What? Wait, Jinbei can cook? Man has a goddamn bandana on too. Wait, hold up. Jinbei can cook? So Jinbei, there's a flim. Uh oh. Uh oh. You know there's a certain fan base that's gonna take these pink flamingos and ride with them shits to like as far as to to fucking Narnia. They're gonna ride these shits like oh shit, hi, go flamingo, impale down, break out. <laughs> He's coming back. Easy, that's I, I, that's happening. Brooke and join some tea. Chopper is using a fork and knife. That's so cute, but that's also pissing me off. He's using a fork and knife to eat pizza. With an aloha on his back. That's, 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 I don't know. Um, Luffy, Nami. Where the fuck is Robin? Hold on, I see Ratatouille. Is that, is, is, is that Chuji? I think, yeah, I think it's Chuji, the mouse that. Wait! Oh my fucking god.
I know she's an introvert, but that doesn't mean that she's going to be reading in the goddamn, you know, back room somewhere. Not enjoying some pizza. What the fuck? No, Frankie, too. Oh. Maybe they're consummating a marriage as we speak. I don't know. You, maybe Frankie's in a... Damn. While g is cooking? Frankie's cooking? Nah. Stop. Nah, nah, nah. That shit's already been sailed. Whoa. That shit's already been sailed. We're done. We're done. We're done. No. Mm -mm. Either way, that's a good one. Yeah. Oh, never mind. There's other mouse here. So we have the mouse over here, Ratatouille's. We have all the stuff. It's cool. It's fun. So Admiral Kizaru has begun his incursion. Get ready. The enemy won't take uh, this line down. So the Marines, they begin their assault. The Navy makes its move. They begin their assault on... Full alert! I'm oh, full alert island. Um, <laughs> on Egghead Island. All right. So, beep 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 beep. Don't let them use their lasers. So we have the Mark III pacifistas, but fire their lasers. Then there is a kaboom. So they fire the cannons before they can charge their lasers. Then we have a, what? What's going on? One of the ships is uh, capsizing, so it's probably the Sea Beast. Yeah, oh, damn. Bro. Shit. Mm. Like, you know what the crazy part is, too? Like, some of these big-ass ships that the Marines have can fit, like, giants on them. And these sea beasts are munching. This lion one, Lionel, the Thundercat one, he's the Battle Beast one, he ripped, he shredded the bottom. Isn't that Sea Stone too? He's shredding through the bottom of this shit. Like it's a goddamn, hey, yo, like he's buying into cotton candy. Oof. So, the be so this beast right here shreds one. Big ass rat. I can already see. What? No way. Is that the mythical last crew member of the Red Air Pirate? Like, niggas, niggas try too hard, yo. <laughs> hey, yo, niggas try too hard. They try too hard. That's uh, that's Shanks' summon, right? Like, he's a Final Fantasy summon? Boom, right there. That's what Shanks is. Okay. So, we have Shanks' summoning over here, the Chew Rat, and the Chew Rat with the drill. The Tang and Topa shit, my boy. Uh, about to come in there and destroy some more ships, too. We have Grimace. What the fuck? Grimace. Steam Knuckle. Go! And then leave our ships alone. Gonna go... Daw! If you wanna... Oh, damn. If it's a fight you want, I'll give you one. The Vice Admirals are touching, are, are touching down. Wait, hold on. Steam Knuckle. Kick... First of all, Doll's legs are way... Is she a long leg? Hold on. Time the fuck out. Whoa. Is Doll... No, I don't think she was that tall before. But the way her leg is drawn, it feels like she's a long leg clan member. One. Two. Grimace has a named attack. And no name. Steam Knuckle. Takes down one of the sea beasts. Or at least punches one. Takes damage. Why does this sound familiar? Steam knuckle, steam knuckle, steam knuckle, steam knuckle. Steam. Why does it sound? It sounds familiar. I just can't pinpoint where it's coming from. Not, no. It's not Luffy, no. I feel like this little character has steam. Z. Thank you. Z's army by Grimace. I think that is Z. Yeah, I think that is. Let me see here. Is that, is that, is that film Z Tech right there? Like Queen had that shit too? Um. I don't think it's his um the Smash Buster or the Buster or the, the Smash Buster or the Smasher the Buster Smasher or the Smash Buster, whatever it's called. I don't think it's that, but I think the attack is similar. The Battle Smasher, thing, yes, it's the Battle Smasher. Yeah, I knew it's not familiar as fuck. Bro, Film Z is so fucking good, dude. I need to do movie watches on Patreon. Okay. So, Labo Stratum. Huh. Labo Stratum. The Marines and Robo Beast are 
the Marines and the Robies at the coast, Usopp film, are really going at it. What up, DDD? Yo, One Piece movie. Yo, listen, we're again. Yeah, we should. We should do movie next One Piece for sure, without a doubt. Um, though, I guess for you, watch all the films. Bro, I'm I'm not trying to get fucked too hard by Vimeo, man. Like, oh man, I wish I did it on Twitch, but it's too risky because I have Twitch plans, so I can't. <clears throat> we'll work it out, okay? Um, Labo Strat of the Marines and Robo Beast are at the coast. We have the Denimushi. Uh, we have uh, looking uh, are really going at it already. But Sentomaru is waiting for them uh, with the squadron of pacifists under his command. It should be clear that the island's defenses are nigh impenetrable. Pacifists to control hierarchy. Five elders, Vega Punk, Stella and Satellite, Sento Maru, Authority Chip Holders. Boom. So we have the Vega Punk, Satellite, Sento Maru, all the pacifists. Are boom. Obviously. So they sent that guy ahead to take out the deterrent? Isn't that Kizaru? Stussy was right. They sent in an admiral. Uh-oh. It seems those dark memories from Shiboni have come back to haunt us, correct, Mundo? They've already started fighting down there. I'm sorry, Sotomaru. Asking you to face him is too cruel. Oh, I'll understand if you choose to flee. Nah, it's too late now. He's already set his ground, dude. He's already pulled up the Florida man status. So he's going to be fighting. And... Sento Maru. <laughs> Do you know what it feels like to be kicked? Oh, actually, I guess he does because he got kicked to the speed like last chapter. Lol. Damn. All right. So Sento Maru blocking this kick from Kizaru, I think. Kizaru, bing! You really ought to surrender, Sento Maru kun. So Kizaru kicks the flash. The web of light bullshit going on here. Ya Yasakani no Magatama. Another of the Imperial Regalia of Japan. Correct. Okay. So Sento Maru. Yasakani no Magatama. Sento Maru takes the kick. Huff, huff. Sorry, Unk. I gave my word to Straw Hat Luffy. So, as. <laughs> bing, 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 bing. Sorry, Unk. Shit. Fuck. <laughs> Sentomaru running away, trying to avoid the uh, orbs of light. His axe. Oh, fuck. Get his axe. Axe. Yes, good man. Brings back. Okay, so he has the axe now. Uh, and since... Ancha, give me a second. Uh, oi, oi, that's bright, kid. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> the, um... Uh... Well, I mean, the orbs are like a wide bombardment move, so... But, of course, you know, <laughs> there is no miracle. Sentomaru is, is kind of doing his job. Yeah, you have to respect it. But he ain't Mark of the Phoenix, you know? Mm. He ain't ma... He's not that nigga right there. So, but he's good. Cole's overrating Sentomaru. What do you mean overrating Sentomaru? What do you mean? Sentomaru tried to block the kick from Kizaru. He got sent packing, but still negated some of that damage. Kizaru does the Yasakai no Magatama. Sentomaru then runs away. Sorry, Unk, I gave my word. Grabs the axe and is about to do some more shit. And since when have you been one to get chummy with pirates? Huff, huff. What do you mean? Hold on, time out. I think what you're doing instead is that <laughs> you're in some ways trying to project your feelings of admiral insecurity onto me. Don't do that, honestly. Don't do that. All right? Come on, bro. Like, look, Chopper dodged a beam of light. So it, I'm not going crazy here. I'm just saying like, yo, Sento Maru is on point right now. Though to be fair, I think he's still going to lose. I think he's still going to lose. I, I, I don't see Sento. 
If I said that Sento Maru was gonna bring Kizaru into a high to extreme diff fight, I bet. You got me. But no! I don't think so. No. I'm just saying, honestly. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Chad, the co-react to the final history. Uh, maybe, maybe not. I, I did my reactions to all that stuff. Uh, I mean, I did a lot of reactions to One Piece stuff on Patreon, and they're posted on my Co Plus channel. So, and I always ping them on my main channel in the community post. So, yeah, either way. Either way, either way. All I'm saying is that right now, Sintamaru, he's, he's doing a good job. So, we have the... Wait, why are the orbs coming? Wait, whoa, hold on. Am I reading this right? Come on, hold on. The orbs come from Kizaru's... You know what these are. But for some reason now, they're coming behind him and above him? What? What's that about? That's weird. I, I feel like it's a mistake. Like, the orbs will be coming here, not from there. Unless Kizaru moved locations, I guess. I don't know, whatever. So, there's a Huff Huff. Jesus. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> I owe the old man my life. I don't care whose side I gotta take if it helps him escape. So, Sento Maru, take this! Goes for a cut. Kizaru... Splits his body in half, and then his upper half of photons shifts to the <laughs> shifts to the top. As Central Maru goes, so I'm serious. So I'm assuming that Central, I'm, so I'm assuming that Kizaru he read that attack and then he dodged probably because Central, Central, Central Maru has hockey clearly. Um, I mean he points out Luffy's hockey at the beginning of the time skip. Duh. So he has hockey. And this is to go into a flashback. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> Sento Maru. Is that? Those are bears. Okay. So, uh, Mama Bear, Papa Bear, and then the kid, Baby Bear, over here. Is that what it is? I forget. So, and this, I thought we were meant to deal with the bear attacks. What happened? Who did this? Some kid beat us to it. Sento Maru fucking yoked out as a kid. Good lord. Um, beat a bear clearly. Um, oh my god, dude, this man's head was way too big back then. The villagers are all wimps. I hate them. I don't. Uh, I don't even want to go back. They they kicked you out, huh? All I need is a job that pays good. I'm tough, so I don't get. I'm tough, so I don't get hungry or anything. Oh, then can I ask, uh, what are, so what you're looking, what you're looking to buy all that money? Onigiri. Kizaru. <laughs> all right. So this man, I don't get hungry or anything. Onigiri, food. Feed me. My boy, you can kill those bears, skin them, eat the fucking fat. Eat the fat of the bear. Apparently bear meat tastes damn good. Apparently bear meat, even fried in bear fat tastes Delicious. But that being said, onigiri. Carbs. <laughs> Do is that actually one? Is that the first time we've seen Kizaru laugh? Stop, Sil. So. That beat down wasn't too hot or too cold, just right? Nah. It should have been too hot. It should have been like these bears should have been grilled the fuck up. Bear steaks. I think that is the first time Kizaru actually laughed. On our rock, I believe so. Yep. Yeah, I think so too. You were so cute back then. <laughs> Kizaru, what are you doing, dude? <laughs> we're in the middle of the fight, right? What is this face? What is this like chew uncle shit? I mean, then again, he is uncle, right? He is uncle. Oh, you were so cute back then. In that case, how would you like my bodyguard, Squirt? You'll really give me a job? Awesome. Hey, Unk. How, Unk, uh, the, hey, Unk, how am I meant to protect Grandpa Punk? Come and teach me. Don't call me that. I'm still young. 
I taught you the best I could. Sentomaru kun. Oh, brother, listen, man, listen, yo, listen, man, listen, yo, I'm just saying, you can do the Spongebob guy in the background, this guy in the, like, this asshole, oh, brother, yes, 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 oh, brother, I did not think Sentomaru would get a shot off on Kizaru, I didn't, freedom, cool, ads, YouTube ad. Twitch ad. Ha. Listen, if you want to know why I'm running an ad, simple. Because those bears, they need the porridge. I got to make sure one's pretty cold. Got to make sure one's pretty hot. And one is just right. So I'll, then that porridge costs money. So I need to make sure I have the right amount of money. A little bit too much money, and maybe uh, undercutting a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I need to make sure everything is a okay. You, you, you feel me? You feel me? All right. W the subs. Yes. You'll see in the long term. There's way more to come. Now, <clears throat> Twitch changed their layout. I don't know how to run it. I did. I did it. These are me. Bruh? Bums? Oh no. It's almost like. <sighs> Why actually, fuck? Can you do no ads as a membership on YouTube? I should. Yeah, I need to give you guys a lot more on the Corecum Con. I need to give you guys a lot more on Corecum. I need, I, I need to figure this shit out. I need to figure out what the fuck should be available for regular people on Corecum. What should be behind a paywall? I need to figure out this shit for you guys, like ASAP. Um. Hmm. Well, I'll do it later. <clears throat> All right, doesn't matter. Ashigata Palm. Or I think it's called the Ashigata Dokoi. Did I say that? So the Ashigata Dokoi, Sumo Strike in Viz. Ashigata is a mountain associated with the legendary Kintaro, who was inspired by Sentomaru design. Obviously. Duh. Cole, stop uh, slobbering over Sentomaru. What do you mean slobbering? Yo, stop coping. Hold on. Time the fuck out. Who actually saw Sentomaru getting a strike in on Kizaru? The fuck? Stop coping. That said, my guard is anything to sneeze either, you know. Oh, shit. Beam! <laughs> yo! Hey, yo, listen. Sentomaru got a strike in. I'm impressed. Coming. Unless that's not blood, that could be debris. I don't know. Whatever. Let's just l let's just say, let's just say that's debris and not any any, any sort of blood. Whatever the fuck. Whatever. Whatever. But damn. Nonetheless, <clears throat> hit Kizaru. One for you to do it. Um, him, Santomaru, and then I guess Whitebeard, kind of, sort of ish, and then Rayleigh. That's a legend. That's a legendary lineup. <laughs> but it's not Kizaru. I mean, it's not Sentomaru that will lead the show against Kizaru. Kizaru, I think, does a finger beam, Frieza style. Fing explosion. I think that's what he did against Sentomaru. Sentomaru. Ooh. Oof. Oof. Unk, I don't feel so good. He doesn't feel good at all. No. Mm, he had way too much Taco Bell. And my boy over here, his bowels are, 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 are turning. All right? Diarrhea incoming at the speed of light. 
Fuck, man. And you can see in the distance right there, the beam, the shining light. All past the... Oh, no. Authority chips, though. Oh, that's what it looks like? Really? Okay. Whew! Okay. Okay. All pacifista units come in. Authority chip. The previous commander issuer is unconscious and out of commission. Authority has been transferred to me. Damn, dude. Is he, though? But let's see here. There's... What if there's going to be a moment where actually Sunmar gets back up? And then... No, no, no. We're that authority. There's been a change of plan. Protect the naval fleet. Sing, dee, 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 and send the weaponized sea beast to the ocean floor. Wow. Yep, the objective of the Pacifica Squadron has been successfully changed. So now, whoa! So now the weaponized sea beasts are going down. All right, so it's time to leave. It's time to leave ASAP. Are we gonna find what happened? Are we get flashbacks. Please tell me we're gonna flashbacks because I want to find. I want to find what the fuck happened. What a waste! What a waste! But I suppose if I had to choose. The past Fester are better assets to secure. Team updated on the casualties uh, incurred. Yes, sir. So, so Damaru, you did you, you did well. Hopefully, I give him enough time to set up some shit to leave. So, <clears throat> Punk Records, uh, the Labo phase, shocked expression somewhere. Damn, Usopp, the footage, yo. Shit, Damaru's finished. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go. Keep going, 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 going. Damn. They're still hacking this thing? Fuck me. Okay. Wow. All right. So, Vegapunk. We can't afford to bleed Dally. Let's lift the defense system. Yeah. We don't, uh, we won't let the time he bought us go to waste. So, we have, yeah, Vegapunk crying. We have, uh, Edison and we have Atlas. They're trying to hack the whole, uh, defense dome, the frontier dome around the labo face, which by the way, we still don't, we still don't know what the fuck it means to be at hundred percent. We have no idea. No idea. Um, <clears throat> what's on here? you won't crack it. Don't forget, I'm a Vegapunk too. He's out of damn Santo Maru. No, not this leg, dude. Not just the leg, yo. Don't do it, yo. Damn, that's not man. But Kizaru. Focus. Kizaru's made of light. He could be pa he could be passing through smart. He could be passing through the laser barrier any minute now. True. Absolutely on point. <clears throat> Kizaru folds. Uh, no, I don't think he folds him. I think he beats him. I don't think he folds kill though. Um Wait, what? You mean he could get yes, indeed. Wait, what? Usopp shook. You mean he can get in whenever he wants to? Come on. You mean he can get in whenever he wants? Yeah. Indeed. That guy almost wiped us out back in the day, you know. Um Jesus. <laughs> My my, the Stripe Pirates, how nostalgic. Bing, just, <laughs> it's just one line, yo. Bing, just, bing, just, just right up there. God damn, dude, Kizaru is crazy, yo. Ugh. So Kizaru, <clears throat> teleports away from Sentomaru. Fish, let's book it. Once the barrier is down, we need it to be ready to get out of here pronto. Way ahead of you. All we need to do is carry the ship over to the back of the island. Let's make it happen. Okay, so the ship, the goddamn dude, this massive fucking robot, the Vega Force One. Oh my god, man. Like, yo, keep in mind this fact, right? Like, it's 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 crazy when you think about it, but like officially, the Sunny Go is taller than the, than. The attack on Titan walls, bro. That's fucking nuts, man. That's just crazy, dude. Like, this thing is massive, bro. What the fuck? 
carrying the sunny go like that is scary big, dude. Yeesh. All right, way ahead of you. All we need to do is carry the ship over the, to the back of the island. That's what's gonna happen. Bet. Ding, 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 ding. Hmm? Little, 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 I can't say her name. Little, little, Lilith, what's that racket? The emergency siren, but why? No one should be able to enter the. No, 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 no. Wrong. Kizaru! Kizaru desu. Jesus. No one should be able to get through the barrier. The power station. Honk Records. And York. Those are the three things that cannot, those are the three things that can't become collateral. Honestly, it would be nice uh, if I could add old friends to the list. Unfortunately though, yeah, dude, damn, dude. Really on Sentomar, man, like, damn, dude, damn. Kizaru beamed up, he's here, bada bing, bada boom. Ding, 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 Enemy, enemy, enemy. Wait, how is that part of the lab just floating in spit? Is anti-gravity there too? I wonder, I forget. Fuck me, how's that possible? That's supposed to, all right, I'm sorry, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got distracted. Mmm, Is that actually dead, I wonder, fuck me. Nah, I don't think so. Dr. Vegapunk's elimination is our top priority. Dr. Vegapunk's elimination is our top priority. Yeah, orders are orders, exactly. So, keys are to the dome, yeah! Ooh, stop freaking out, as per usual. Luffy and the others are still making their way back. Hurry, Luffy. Luffy-san, this isn't looking good. It'd be pointless to lift the barrier if the ship is in position. So SSG, uh, they're still they're still hacking. Usopp, Nami, freaking the fuck out. Rob Gooch, I see you. What? Oh, sh oh! Mm. Sly Cooper and Thieves! Oh! Swiper, no swiping! Fuck you, bitch! I'm swiping your life! Oh! Stussy! Why are you sweating? You were so confident before! Where's the vampiric... Where's that crazy... Like, succubus activity? Where's the... Hello? Nah. The pigeon move. Purple! Yeah! <laughs> Rob Luch! Hey! Even the hat went off too. Rob Lucci goes for a strike. Yo, listen. Rob Lucci is not a rat. He is the most honorable feline in the verse. Alright, he is a he he is the buff version of Tom and Jerry, yo. Like the hella buff version. Walking into the room after getting fucking yoked out. He never betrayed the Marines. He never betrayed the Marines. But what do you mean? It's called being a double, not nah, even a double agent. They don't, Luffy didn't even trust this nigga. If Luffy doesn't trust you, then you know, come on. He never, he never betrayed the Marine. I don't smell, I don't smell any bitch. No, I don't, I don't smell any rat. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't smell it. I don't smell it at all. He's licking the boots of Tenubito, dude's a scum. I mean, that's his job. <laughs> that's his job. He gets paid. What do you mean, huh? What do you mean? What? Bro. <laughs> Listen. Everyone in America somehow, some way is paying, is, is, is licking the boots of Uncle Sam. It's called taxes, all right? This one over here, shit. He promised me he wouldn't go after the others to the. No, 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 no. The other crew members. I, I assume it was other crew members. Like, he wouldn't go after his crew. Not big a punk. And besides, who cares? Wait! That's his job! He's doing his job. No, 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 no. Listen, if you think that Rob Lucci is a rat, you're fucking Rob. You're Rob wrong. Rob Lucci is doing his job. He's a real one. Yeah, thank you. I think he's a real one. He he, ne he never would side with the strats on anything. Fuck you mean? He hates these niggas. What the fuck you mean? That being said, 
cripple. What? Oh, <gasps> damn. First of all, damn for one obvious reason. Damn. Use your judgment. Number two. Damn. She actually, she's ride or die. What is this? Holy fuck, dude. She is one of like Tate's women, man. Just will stay with the thing for the rest of his life, no matter what. How is this possible? This is weird. You know, actually, maybe not. Because I guess she genuinely did appreciate, respect, and like Dr. Vegapunk. Bro. So, yo. She gun? Stussy got fingered away. I sound like Boji right now. Uh, yeah, Stussy got fingered. It wasn't fun. Bleeding. Uh, cherries apparently popped. And Robucci's like, you know what? I like this. This is good. This makes me happy. Okay, it makes me very, very happy. So Rob Lucci went in there, stabbed, blood. Vega Punk, what? No way. And then Vega Punk, what? Stussy! Stussy chair? Hello? Look at the nigga with the goddamn crazy goatee with the blood on his finger. Hello? Sorry, not me, son. I'm buying this. What the hell is this? Smart move, Sanji. Holy shit. Smart play, Sanji. Sanji, big, you know what I mean? Sanji, big brain, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Sanji, big brain, yo. Sanji got it. Yo, I'm... he's pulling out his, uh, his, his film Z. Unironically. Give me that gun. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm buying this. Huh? What? <laughs> Give me that. Kaku can't move now. No! Kaku was trying to! Kaku was trying to! Fuck! Let me out of the bubble! No. What? The bubble gun? Nah. Seems her friend left you out of the loop. Huh? Zoro! Damn, why are you so slow, though? You should have gotten the... I... Hold on. No. You know what it is, dude? Because it's... It's more apparent in the anime because they kind of show with Queen... There are people that can, like, snuff out their presence. Oda's not clear about this, but some characters have, like, some sort of, like, Zetsu thing that they can do, and then they can, like, suppress their presence. And because I remember that kind of happened with um, the minks. Like, Luffy was surrounded by minks, and then as a result, he was able to... Well, the minks had him surrounded, but even though he had hockey, like, he knew the observation hockey. So I'm thinking that Rob Lucci, I'm, I'm giving him a buff here. Rob Lucci could have, because he, he, you don't, you barely see Rob Lucci. Rob Lucci's like hidden the corner right here. Like you barely see his ass. And then he strikes at the right time. So that's probably the reason why um, Sanji, Zoro, they couldn't sense Rob Lucci's attack. Or even Stussy. Oh, maybe she, well, she, she blocked. Never mind. So she, she, she was there. Either way. Coping? Maybe. Maybe. Who knows? So, the gun shuts down Kaku. Ka. Huh? And then, sword clash. Oh, not sword clash. We have the swords versus the leg. Block. Looks like you waited for backup to grow a spine. Uh-oh. Zoro! He did his job! <laughs> Wait! Wait! Rob Lucci is an assassin! Why the fuck should an assassin be, I'm gonna stand here like a man and fight you head to head? Like, nigga, that, what are you talking? He's an assassin! Bro, if I hire a fucking ninja and he's like Black Star, he runs out into the open, who wants to fight me? Nigga, you're fucking fired. You're fired, bro. What are you talking about? If, if, if Swiper just walked in front of... 
Listen. Okay. Fuck. <sighs> Assassins have got to do their job, okay? I don't want to go down the rigmaroles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, I don't want to go down the rigmaroles, okay? I'm just saying. There's a reason why the Red Wedding is so damn good. Because fucking the Boltons <clears throat> assassinated the Starks, okay? Just because you're an assassin doesn't mean that you're a fucking rat. Rats are traitors, okay? Rats are niggas that backstab. These fucking clowns, for some reason, spoiler my ass, these fucking traitors, these idiots, wanted to bring Rob Luch into the fold. No, you're playing with fire. You're one of those idiots at the circus with the goddamn flaming sticks like, yay, and it's day one. Nigga, you know what you're doing. And then you burn yourself. It's one of these idiots that drink those alcoholic frozen, uh, alcoholic flame beverages like, yeah. And all of a sudden the whole body's on fire. Like, yeah, nigga. I'm just saying. <sighs> I'm defending Rob Lucci for doing his job. All right, looks like you wait for backup to grow a spine. You're all as good as dead. Now that he's, uh, now that he's and I are working together. Oh, he's confident. Just, what do you fucking mean? Whoa. Whoa. Sir. That's Kizaru's hype and confidence. Like, yo, listen, Kizaru's got this. He's got this. He's got, he's got this. Says the man that got Dawn rocketed and fucking three-pieced. This man got the dollar. He got the 50 cent menu at McDonald's. He got three pieces, dude. Fuck you mean, bruh. All right. I'm going to see here. Well, I'm, I'm telling you now. He's always getting that sauce. He's not going to be Luffy. Or hopefully in the future. Sanji. But again, we have to, we have to, we have to, <laughs> we have to actually hold on time out. You're as good as Edna Kizar and I work together. You should know by now, not even us. Luchi versus Zoro? Well, that's interesting. Luchi versus Zoro. Another, another African animal, bro. Oda just can't stop with the racism, dude. He just can't stop with the racism. It's every arc he has to take on melanated niggas, whether they're actually melanated or spiritually melanated. It's always the same shit. Zoro sniff. Zoro is one of the highest ranking members of Candyland. He smells a degree, any degree of melanation, and he has to strike. Come on. What are you talking about? He probably thinks that this man, Rob Lucci, has three dimples in the back of his skull, like good old Ben. Bro, yo, Zoro, Zoro ain't beating no allegations, dude. Zoro, Zoro ain't beating no allegations. It's none, zero. No, come on. Kaku, see, Sanji, he's a good nigga. You know why? He puts Kaku in the bubble. He puts Kaku in the bubble, so he's confined. He does his job. Zoro strikes with aggression, all right? So he's the bad cop. Good cop, Sanji over here. Yeah, I got him, don't worry about it. Clear, he broke the law, he's going to prison, bad. 
Zorro. I'm gonna plant some marijuana in the back of his car, and I'll make sure he's going to prison for the rest of his goddamn life. These, these, these people don't understand what it really means to enact justice. Like fucking a oh, dude, damn, oh, these people, man, fuck. All right. Also, another kinsman of the green color, green bull, same energy. Look, I'm just saying, another African animal has to get cut down by the poacher, Ronor Zorro. Your girl's good dead now that Keys are and I working together. You should know by now that's us. Blah, blah, blah. And we have, uh, I was wondering where their ship got when I went, damn, how big, okay. I was wondering where their ship got to when I didn't see it at shore. Hurry. They sent an admiral, Luffy, what should you do? Hey, hmm, hey, Luffy, here, here, here it is. Uh, break, okay, yeah, there's a break. Yeah, so th this, oh, man. This, I was aware of. Yeah, I, 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 I actually, um, I should mention that earlier in the stream. I was aware there was a break. I was aware that there was a break. I was aware. Yeah, I know. I know we're not done yet. I know. No. I, I can see that there's something else I, I, after this picture here. But there is a break, which is like crazy. But here we go. Okay. After this was this. Huh? Hey, yeah. Long time. <laughs> hey, yeah. Long time no see. Mm. Uh -huh. What? Whoa! Kizaru! Luffy! <laughs> Kizaru! <laughs> Luffy coming in there with the Conqueror's hockey on the boots? I see that you're as cheeky as ever. We're a hundred times stronger than we were two years ago, Kizaru. Engaging an admiral, it's time. It's time. That, that's the chapter. It's time. Luffy with the high kick on Kizaru. Sup, dude. Uh, sup, nigga. Yeah. We build different today. We. <laughs> yeah, what's good, baby? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. We build different today. Hip, hip, hooray. Because I'm going to take you down, big boy. I'm taking you down. Kizaru, I don't think he's winning. I, I've said before a million half times. I don't think he's winning. Um, and that's how Luffy is going to separate himself from Lawn Kid. Lawn Kid, they lost. But Luffy's going to win. Or whatever that really means. Although, I need to see how we're going to get... Is Jay Garcia Saturn just gonna really sit on his ass? I don't think so, no. There's gotta be something with that he does, right? Cause I'm thinking about it now, like maybe the event that shocks the world is an animal being defeated, but at the same time, I want more. It could be just Kizar being defeated, but I don't think so. I think it's gonna be more. I think it's gonna be way more than that. Either way, Seraphim? What about Seraphim? <laughs> Kizar over Kaido? Fuck no. What? Whoa, dude, we, we, <laughs> we already know the paradigm. We already know, all right? All right, another admiral, Green Bull, is like, nah, dude, I'm not coming here if Kaido's here. You fucking crazy? Yeah. What? No. This is no. It's already no. Laffy's going to capture Saturn. Ooh, you see, that's, I've, oh, yeah. I need to do that video. My idea is that, like, you do have Blackbeard become, he's actually able to make his own country by capturing Blackbeard, by capturing um uh, Saturn. That would be the play that I had in mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, we, we talked about last stream. Yeah, that, but... I feel like there could be more that Kizaru does. I mean, more that involves Saturn directly with the strats, because at some point, the strats have to care about the Gorosei. I mean, I guess I mean, they do now in some ways, because they talked over the Denimushi, but yeah. Uh, Luffy season? Kizaru, no. No. No, dude. Not even close. Kizaru has to do so much to be over Kaido. He has to do so fucking much, man. Nah, I don't think it's possible. I don't think it's possible for any animal to be over Kizaru. Oh, 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 over Kaido. Oh, wait, time out. Unless people are taking this one kick, like, it's the strongest attack Luffy's ever done in the entirety of One Piece, and then Kizaru is blocking that strongest attack. No, oh, I can see it, dude. I can see it, dude. Oh, he's conquers hockey on the kick? It's, like, better than the buzz ring gun, and he's blocking the casual. Like... Oh, please. <laughs> Book. 
please take the SATs. Study. There's no way. Please. All right. Oh, fuck. I can see it. Oh, I'm like a goddamn. I'm tapping into my inner psyche. I'm trying to reach to the cosmos. And I'm seeing. I'm seeing dumb shit. I'm seeing dumb shit everywhere. Fuck. Okay, I can see it. All right. He's always, He's not. Oh, well, maybe. No. My book is already set in stone. Luffy wins. He wins. He wins. Black Lightning. A yeah, I know it. Black Lightning. It, this is a conqueror's hockey attack. Time out. We already saw with Garp and Kuzan. You can match a conqueror's hockey infusion attack without having conqueror's hockey infusion. Who says that you can't block a conqueror's hockey? Of course you can. What are you talking about? Duh. But yeah, of course, yeah. But, oh. <laughs> Hold on, time out. I just saw. Hey, yo. YouTube has a feature now where they can automatically run ads on YouTube. Like, they put the, they, they self-insert the ads. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Shout out to YouTube. Love you guys. All right? Um... No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not trying to be fucked up, but you know, that's funny. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll work something out to where you guys have no ads. I promise. Okay. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> we'll work something out. Uh, premature. Yeah, yeah. Just get, just get, just get premium. Uh, that's not advanced. No, it is. I think it is. No, it is. The bolts are too big. I think the bolts. Oh, okay. Look, to me, okay, I'll, I'll keep it a stack. To me, this looks like Conqueror's Hockey Infusion. I'll be surprised if it wasn't. But then again, I don't necessarily blame you if you think it's not, since Oda himself isn't clear that, you know, I, I think it is. I, th I, I think the bolts are big enough to where they could constitute as Conqueror's Hockey Infusion. And they're with the attack itself, right? They're not like outside of the attack. They're with the attack itself. Um, whereas like with armor hockey, you seem kind of use that for the follow attack, like 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 the follow up. But then when the attack actually hits, you don't see the bolts there. As far as I recall, like Kobe's um, honestly impact, you see him do the shockwave thing, but there's no actual bolts of lighting on the shockwave. Compare that to Garp's uh, galaxy impact, you see the bolts of hockey on the actual shockwave itself. Wow, Oda sucks at that, dude. Like, honestly, Oda fucking sucks major monkey dick at this. I, it, 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 it's annoying where the dis the differentiation between armor hockey lightning bolts and Congress hockey shit is so unclear, you could genuinely argue that maybe it's not Congress hockey, it's actually armor hockey, and it's the clash between the two hockeys of Kizaru and Luffy fighting each other out. But I think... You can safely assume it is Conqueror's Hockey, given the degree, given the severity, given the length of the bolts. I think. Maybe. Possibly. Potentially. Whatever. Either way. Kizaru blocks, and Kizaru's like, oh, so your shoes ever. We're a hundred times... That feels familiar, too. We're a hundred times stronger. All right, I, I, I forget. Uh, it, it feels familiar, but I just don't know where I'm... No. Stop keyboard, please. Yeah, I don't know. All right, whatever. It doesn't matter. All right. Shocky? Shocky said that? Did she? About what? Wait. Ray Rayleigh. Oh, she said, what was it? Some like chapter 498. I think it was something like, don't worry about Rayleigh. He's stronger than you. I, oh yeah, I think you guys are right. Hold on, let me see. I'm, 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 I'm forgetting here. Uh, I, I'm forgetting here, but I think you guys are right. I think she said like, don't worry about Rayleigh or something like that. And then she mentioned how strong he was compared to them. I think so, yeah. 
Ooh, who wants to do a Doriki check? Ooh. <laughs> who wants to do a Doriki check? Yeah. Ah, okay, you're right. He's about a hundred times stronger than you boys. Okay, bet. So now we know that Luffy, I'm assuming the entire crew. So Luffy, Zoro, Nami, Usopp, Sanji, Chopa, Robin, Brr, Frankie, Brook, they're all a hundred times stronger than they were back then. Bet. Roughly. Bad. Bad, 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 bad. Okay, cool. I'll take it. Really? Luffy's really able to confirm? No. What? No. No. Time out. No. No. Well, yeah, not literally, but they're stronger. Yeah, 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 no. I'm just taking it. I'm just making it more literal. But, yeah, obviously. Obviously, obviously. They're, it's not like one for one for one, right? Like, is Usopp actually a hundred times stronger? Not, not really. I mean, he's kind of like the same dude. He has more muscle, true. But a hundred times? Like, is he Ronnie fucking Coleman? A straight up specimen? Woo! Yeah, no, nah, he's not that. <laughs> he's not that. He's not that. You know what I'm saying? Um. Uh, yeah, I, I, I know, I know. But I'm saying, like, it'll be a fun video to, let's say, do... Hey, like a hundred times stronger. Like, how powerful does that really retro? Retro? Yeah, actually, that'd be a fun video to do. Like, hey, Law is a hundred times stronger now than it was back then. So, what does that really mean? You know, like that'd be a fun video. It's kind of over. Uh, all right. He's not worried about Luffy now. Wait, tell me, whoa, 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 whoa. Old man Rayleigh literally said that he had no fucking chance of beating Blackbeard. Ain't no fucking way he's over Luffy. Luffy has a chance. Come on, bro. I don't think he win. But he has a much better shot of beating Blackbeard than old man Rayleigh does. Fuck no. Fuck no. I mean, wait, time the fuck out. If, oh, damn, you know what? Oh, shit, dude. Yeah, this is gonna be true as fuck. You know what you realized? I don't know if Luffy's gonna go into gear five immediately. I wanna see how Luffy in base form fares against Key's order. I need to see this. Oh, shit, I need to see this. I need to see this ASAP. I mean, I think they will go to Gear 5 at some point, but I'm just going to go to Gear 5 immediately. Does Zachi pull for this? Kizaru low mid... <clears throat> Luffy high mid diff. Luffy high mid diff, easily. Um, again, th there's no real point having Luffy lose to Kizaru um, at this stage in the game. When he has to deal with stronger guys than that. He has to deal with guys like Blackbeard in the future. Uh, a future Big Mom, obviously. He has to deal with um, Emu. He has to deal with Shanks. He has to deal with potentially the return of the legendary Joy Boy, right? As folks theorize. Uh, Dragon could be a final villain, who the hell knows. So he has to deal with more powerful niggas. There's, there's, there's no point. We're in the final saga right now. When it looks like Kizaru? Kizaru's not final fucking villain material. Are you crazy? Hell no. Either way. Kaido is like... Come on. Green Bull already said that he would never come to Wano Country if Kaido was around. A kind who's like, please, don't, don't do it, kid, please. And Green Bull and Kizaru are relatively equal. Now, I put Kizaru over Green Bull. Yes, obviously. But they're all admirals.
So that 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 that, that being said, let's see how it goes. All right, so YouTube, you guys have my undivided attention. Thoughts, comments, concerns, drop them now, and then we'll get to them. So, um, Thomas White, I'm choosing violence. All this chapter shows is that Kizaru is slower than Garb, who was able to blitz Kuzan when Kizaru couldn't even blitz Sentomaru. And Kizaru is weaker than Luchi because he couldn't one-shot Sentomaru. Oh, that's violence. Mm. That's violence. Thomas White is uh, going hard. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, is that wing? I got <laughs> Oh, shit. No, that's not wing. I don't think wing appreciates Rob Luchi like that. Which is unfortunate, because Rob Lucci, Rob Lucci, I think, is a lot stronger than Focus Room Credit 4, I'll be honest. Um, but at the same time, oh, you know what it is, dude? Oh, fuck me. You know what it is? Right here. People were shitting on Rob Lucci early in the year. He blocked Zoro's attack. Stocks are going high. Star. I, I, have him the, I have Rob Lucci in the same spot. I think he's first division commander-ish level. But, like, in the middle to bottom rung of that. So, I do put Zor over Rob Lucci. Just innately. Damn, dude. Oh, fuck. But, damn. I can already see it. What? He blocked Zoro. He's fucking Yonko level. It's over. And then when Zoro, if Zoro can beat Rob Lucci. You know how it goes. You fucking know how it goes, dude. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, GDN. Kiyakuzan was secretly Mike Tyson. Kizaru is the shield hero, specializing defense based on training Sento. What's next? Akainu is a marksman? Uh, I mean, to be fair, to be very, very fair, it's not like it's impossible to believe that Kizaru doesn't have high defense because we already saw that when he helped block Whitebeard Shockwave in Water 7. Um, no, uh, in um, uh, Marine Ford, where we see Akainu, Kuzan, and Kizaru do this thing right here. They make, assumingly, an armor hockey wall to block that Shockwave. So, they have high defense for sure. Though I'm more, I'm more shocked with Sento Maru, where Sento Maru could get like a hit off on Kizaru, seemingly no damage because he did use that defense, probably hockey to block the attack. But it is impressive that that's, that Sento Maru can actually get a shot, like actually tag Kizaru, which is like what the fuck. Like, but here we are. <clears throat> Abyssal Leviathan. Here we go. Luchi. Luchi just one shot a rocks pirate. Kaido with three days could barely do anything. Zoro and Sanji need to team up to stand any sort of chance. Listen, we have no idea how powerful Bakken was back in the day. One. Two, is that didn't Stussy already admit earlier this year, that in a head-to-head -head fight, she couldn't beat Rob Lucci? She already admitted that. That she couldn't beat Rob Lucci in a head-to-head -head fight. So she had to use shenanigans and trickery to actually beat Rob Lucci. <sighs> but if you do need... Zoro and Sanji to tag team to take down Rob Lucci, I may give you your flowers. I don't think so, but I may give you your flowers. I think that 
because Zoro's fighting Luchi and Luffy's fighting against uh, Kizaru, Sanji's gonna be the one to guard everybody else. Because that's what Sanji's main job is. Sanji's other job is always like lead and command everybody else for the most part to like do certain things. So like Sanji immediately shuts down Kaku. Then we have to kind of figure out what the hell's going on now at this point in time. Uh, probably have Luffy catch up later. Zoro, the same thing. But he may get lost knowing Zoro. So we'll have to see. Uh, he may just wind up accidentally back with the Vega Force Mark One and um, you know that kind of shit. So we'll have to see. Either way. Uh, uh, GDN. Zoro versus Luffy. Sloppy seconds. Extreme diff soon. Uh, you know what? This. Oh fuck. Oh GDN. GDN. Luchi, Kizaru, and Ichen. Help me. Man, dude. It's gonna be a toxic day. There's gonna be so much copium just floating around the air. If Luchi brings Zoro to an extreme dead fight. Cause Luffy three pieces, nigga. He three pieced him. He did a fucking mole pistol. Then he fucking tune whipped his ass into the fucking wall. Slapped on some goggles. Dawn rocket, dude. Oh man. Oh good lord. If if that happens, it's gonna be. Ooh. Like avoid Twitter at all costs. Or post some shit and then leave. Walk away. <laughs> Just post that shit and leave. Walk the fuck away. Because it's going to be really, really hard to say that Rob Lucci is like Admiral level-ish, even close to that area, when Luffy is gonna have to have like a high or extreme diff. Maybe I don't think I don't think extreme honestly, but let's say a high diff fight versus Kizaru when he crushed Rob Lucci. He fucking crushed Rob Lucci, man. The only way you can safely, kind of ish, maybe probably argue that Rob Lucci or Zoro kind of gets that uh that leeway. Is if Rob Lucci is like heavily No, hold on, actually I'm lying. If Rob Lucci is nerfed, not at full power, then it actually looks worse for Zoro if Zoro is going extreme diff with Luffy. Cause the idea is simple, right? A lot of people want Zoro to be closer to Luffy than he is to Sanji. Because people just are, are are always running away from Robin's words. They're 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 they're, they're just sprinting as far as they possibly as, as fast as they possibly can. The problem is that Luffy is just like extra busted, man. Like Luffy's just like so fucking busted, it's insane. Like the idea was that Zoro would be similar to Rayleigh in quote unquote some way, where like Rayleigh and Roger are theoretically close. Even though I never thought that, but they were like theoretically close to each other. But I mean, Luffy, dude, Luffy's so fucking powerful, man. It's like, no, I, I don't see. <laughs> like, Zoro's great. He's, he's amazing. But Luffy's just nuts. Like, Luke, the, the gap between Luffy and Zoro. Is like the gap between Frankie and Usopp, dude. <laughs> okay, maybe not that high, but it's high. <laughs> it's it's pretty hot. Um, Princess of the Monsters, Luchi ain't melanin. Snitch activity, Zoro doing God's work. That's Cap. That's Luchi. That's Luchi. That's Luchi. All right. 
Lucci is the majestic African leopard. Lucci is from the motherland. I don't think Zoro escapes allegations. I'll be honest with you. I don't think he escapes allegations. Black Lightning. Tell me why a woman almost got killed and Zoro reacted faster than Sanji. Uh, where is the observation hockey? Well, that's what's going on before. It's like, I think that the idea is that Lucci was able to hide his presence somewhat to avoid their hockey. It's not consistent with Oda. Like, oh, the most inconsistent ability in One Piece is observation hockey. Um, the characters tend to have it on a regular basis, but characters that do have it, like Kid has it, Law has it, Queen has it, Kid has it, Doflamingo has it, Cracker has it, but they don't really show it. Like, Jack has it, but they don't really show distinct observation hockey. So it kind of feels like, in a general sense, they can just perceive things quicker than normal um, because they have that ability. Um, that's the first thing. Second thing is that Sanji did react pretty damn quick afterwards where he shut down Kaku. Grab the gun, Kaku sealed, can't do shit, we're done. And then Zoro's quick too. Zoro's quick too. Like, yeah, like... Listen, I'll keep it a stack. The best nigga with this hockey would be Katakuri, all right? Katakuri, I think... Well, okay. <laughs> Katakuri is the second best observation hockey user right now in the story. Because he had that on all the damn time. And he would see everything. He would know... Luchu would attack immediately. He would know. Like, what the hell are you doing? Stop. That's the first thing. Second thing. The best one is Shanks. Rat King, Rat King, Shanks. He's the number one by far. Like it's not even, it's, 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 he could not, own, why? It's simple. Because he was able to see the future of what was going on when his ship was docked at the coastline and Kid's ship is like miles away. He's able to see what's going on in the future for like, a way longer range than what Katakuri could do. And he was able to do that for a full 10 seconds. A full 10 seconds, he saw the complete future. Then, when we see the whole Green Bull thing, how the fuck did Shanks know that A, Green Bull was there, B, that he was an enemy, he was a Navy man? How did he know that? That range is even fucking bigger than what NL could do in Skypea. Because the, the Red Force ship is docked, not docked, not docked, but the Red Force ship is so far away from Wano Country, you can't even see the borders of Wano Country. That's how far away he is. And Shanks knew, Shanks knew. He says, hey, Navy man, how'd you know that? How did he know that Greenville was a Navy man from like a thousand, two thousand miles away. How do you know? He just knew. <clears throat> the observation. Shanks is number one, absolutely. Like, positively, the number one in all hockeys. Armor hockey, I think by default, it is what it is there. Um, but Congress hockey, very obvious. Observation hockey, that's also something very, very, very obvious. Very, like, Shanks is just. Nuts. He's nuts. How did he know that it was Green Bull? He, he said Navy man. How'd you know that? Two, three thousand miles away. How do you know that? How? Nah. He built different, yeah. Oh, uh, great. Zoro finally ready to face a prime time. <sighs> that's for okay, that's a prime time. Zoro. Finally ready to face a pre-time skip Luffy enemy. Meanwhile, Luffy boxed with Kizaru. Stop. Listen, Zoro. 
Rob Lucci is beating any third division commander. Everything else of the wing scene. <clears throat> oh, 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 GDN, five. If there is no inference, if there is no inference, it's Kizar versus Luffy, low, mid, high, or extreme diff. Low key, I can see Oda doing any of them, maybe high if Logi awakening. So, I think that, and then I, I know people, I know people, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, 2,000 miles. Yeah, no, hold on, time, work out. It's not Keem. Yeah, 2,000 miles, all right? 2,000 miles. Keep in mind that officially, officially, Zunisha is as large, as long as Manhattan. And Zunisha couldn't see the Boroswano country where it was located from. Zunisha. Shanks in that same area. So if it takes several Zunishas to get to just the borders of Wano country, like five, six Zunishas, then getting to just the borders of Wano country would be like approaching a thousand miles. Either way. At least in theory, in theory, of course. But I would say that Kizar versus Luffy is going to be at least a high diff. I want to say high diff to extreme diff. I personally, right? Here, here's my stance. I don't think that Luffy is on the same level as Kaido currently. I know some folks believe that, but Kaido to me had to go through like a survival mode. He had to go through the gauntlet. And then Luffy, mind you, Luffy gets a break. Luffy gets snack time while Kaido's dealing with Yamato and the scabbards. And then Luffy gets, um, well, he gets like killed again. And, uh, to be fair, he does take that um, Thunder Bellow Bagua by Luffy uh, from Kaido. And then he gets knocked down. He gets quote unquote killed. And then he goes to the awakening. But Kaido is still matching Luffy. He, he's still up there with Luffy. In fact, Luffy's Bajran gun, Kaido could have easily dodged, but he chose to take the attack. So the only thing I could say for Luffy over Kaido is that Luffy does have higher attack power than Kaido. That's really it. Everything else gone Kaido superior. So I have Kaido over Luffy still. One, two, is that I and I I, I know people hate this and i'm not saying it's like a one for one nuance and context are clearly important but i believe that oda is going to adhere somewhat to the bounties that the characters have here we go here we go here we go again i'm not saying it's always the case it's all always one for one for one no but listen up Garp, in theory, Kuzan, but let's not say Kuzan. Garp, Greenbull, Fujitora, Luffy, Kid, and Law. All of these guys have the same bounty, the three billion berry bounty. So in theory, all of them are relatively in the same ballpark. I'm not saying it has to be all of them are equal. No, I put Kizaru ahead of Greenbull and Fujitora because he has more tenure as a Marine than those two guys do, all right? I put Law over Kid because Law has better feet. <laughs> yeah. Law has better feet than Kid. Law has, I think, like the third strongest attack, I'd argue, in the series. Maybe like even, well, maybe fourth strong, uh, fifth, right? Like, Law has some gnarly things going for him. But based on the portrayal, Kid has good things going for him too. And also, I guess, feats too. He, he has good feats for like endurance, that kind of stuff. Fair enough. He, he does. He, very good, very good feats for, for endurance. Very good feats. Luffy technically is in that same ballpark too. Technically. But I have Luffy over Kizaru. So I'm going to put Luffy over Kizaru. And I think that, narratively speaking, it makes the most sense where Kid and Law, they would lose to Shanks and Blackbeard because they're not the real contenders for the One Piece treasure. But Luffy beating Kizaru 
Luffy is clearly the prime time contender for the One Piece treasure. I, he's gonna get it. Whereas other characters aren't gonna get it. Luffy will be King of the Pirates. Luffy will be. Luffy, right? And when you think about it, what is gonna be this shocking moment that's gonna shock the world? That's gonna stun, stun lock the world? It makes no sense for it to be Luffy's defeat. That makes no damn sense. So stun the world, Luffy's defeated. No. What makes the most sense is if the Marines take another hard L. The hard L. The hard L. That will truly shock the world, where they have a force of 30,000. You have St. J. Garcia Saturn, a Goro say. He's there too. And then they catch L's by Monkey D's Luffy. That's our say. So I'm, I'm not bounty scaling, per se. It, it, it just makes the most sense to have them in the same ballpark considering their bounties and also even based on feats. Kid has undeniably very good endurance feats. Undeniably. He got stronger after the time, um, after two weeks of a uh, time. Was it two weeks of time? I um, law the same thing. Law the same thing. So, that being said, People want to clown on the bounty scaling stuff, but it's not really bounty scaling. It's just a frame of, it's like a baseline. It gives us a kind of where it's the baseline here and then where can we go from there? And does it make sense? And it makes a lot of sense. It makes a lot of sense. But yeah, that's, that's really it. Okay. They made their bounty the same to downplay Luffy, bro. Well, Luffy being Kizaru would be the way he severed himself from Kid and Law. Yeah. And again, something you have to keep in mind too, is that an admiral is given their position because of their combat skills. The admirals are given their position because they are the greatest military, uh, the quote unquote, greatest military force the world government has to offer, okay? You cannot be weak and be an admiral by default, full stop. And the cross guild is a numerical value on their combat skills. Three bill. Just three bill. Full stop. So now we know what that means. And it makes a lot of sense now why Greenville could, let's say, be stronger than commanders, but not want to go into Wano country when Kaido's there. Okay. Oh, so that being said, got to your question. I would say Kizaru lose to Luffy, but I still want to say it's like a high diff fight. I don't think it's going to be a cakewalk. By by no measure. What is this? Hey, that's cool. Uh, Prince of the Monsters. Ten. Straw Hats are leaving clean. Only two-thirds of the monster trio are busy, leaving Jean Bay and Sanji to neg diff the fleet and the other Straw Hats and Vegapunk to get uh, on the ship already. Uh, Garcia better move. I think that we're just going to try and escape at this point in time. We're, we're going to have... I don't know how... I'm not sure what, what, what we're going to see Garcia do, honestly. But there's a good chance here where we don't see the strats go down to the Labo area at all. At all. And, I mean, um, the, the Fabio phase at all. And then we just kind of hightail out of there. I, I, I think that's very, very possible. Because I think the Odin won't end this arc this year. So, even though he's been uh, taking a lot of these breaks, apparently he was there in L.A. Uh, incognito mode, watching everybody do their thing. Fair enough, fine. Oda just, you know, he, with his Crocs, he was just chilling, which is kind of cool. But I think for the, yeah, I, I want to say for the most part. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want to say for the most part that they just focus on getting out. And we may have some clash here or there. But that's really it. We have to wait to because we have to wait for them to actually remove the remove the frontier dome around the entire area. Yeah, so let's see. They could have more fights, but I'm not too sure. We have to wait and see. We have to wait and see. Uh, 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 Shinkai. By the way, last chapter was Luffy's "The Damage is Too Severe" moment. This chapter and onwards will be proving it. The damage is too severe moment. Um, for what? Oh, wait, you mean with Luffy? I mean, with Luchi? 
was last chapter. Well, I, I know what you mean. Last chapter was Luffy's the damage too severe moment. I'm not sure what that means. The damage is too severe. Luffy. Oh, no, I, I missed something because I'm not sure what that means exactly. We have to wait and see, because I need to see also what's gonna happen with the. Uh, oh yeah, true. I forget. You have the Blackbeard Pirates. They're there too. They 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 gotta do something. Yeah. <clears throat> Shows his kid. Oh okay okay. Wait hold on. No, even still, what does that mean? Huh? Oh okay. No, I think I follow you. I don't think so though. So you think that it's gonna be like okay, he's always gonna like blitz around. And then, you know, kill, let's say, Vegapunk, something like that. Luffy's like, no, no way. That can't happen. He goes into Gear 5 and just destroys Kizaru. Notice how Zoro is sweating against non-transformed Luffy. <laughs> Fuck. Notice how Zoro is sweating against a non-transformed Luffy. Last chapter, Luffy was sweating, but he, once he realized it's Kizaru, he's chilling. Luffy is under Zoro. By a little bit, but then they're massively under Kizaru, who's under Luffy. Luchi stock on the rise. Zoro stocks dip. I mean, true. To be fair, people were saying last time, like, "Oh fuck, here comes Kizaru!" Like Luffy sweating, but he's smiling and happy now. Yeah, Zoro. This is a big facts, though. Zoro is sweating. I can't deny that. Emperor Beast Kaido. You still think admirals are closer to the commanders than Yonko? Um, uh, yeah, for sure, guaranteed. Um, well, to be to be to be clear, I would say the the past era is Yonko. The current Yonko are like all the place, but like I would say Big Mom, Kaido, Shanks, and Whitebeard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or even guys Blackbeard too. Yeah. Uh, oh fuck, what's this? Oh shit, what happened? By the way, last time Luchi sent Zoro through a building, now Zoro sent him through a building. Um, oh, wait, he threw him? Yeah, okay, I, I suppose there's a parallel there. I'm right, sure, why not? Uh, though, Luchi's blocking as they go out of the area. So, uh, it's, not, it's, not, it's not the same energy. But, but, but for you, though. Getting uh, uh Getty GM, I see you. Luffy, Bajran Guns versus Shanks Divine Departure. Bajran Gun. Um Bajran Gun, I think strong second we've seen in um what, what is it? I think we have I did the I did the video doing the what was it? I did the video doing the the masterclass video. It's a long video, it's like an alpha's long. It's the strongest the strongest attacks in One Piece currently. Luffy's Bajran Gun, after all after all, all information. I think we had at like, we had at multi-continental minimum on the low end for Luffy's Bajran gun. I don't think Shanks is there. I think that attack for Shanks is not there. I think he has that for sure without a doubt, even probably beyond. But um, yeah, so, uh, but the Bajran gun I think is the most powerful attack in One Piece. Um, and I have to find out more about the minutia, what that fire was too, because that fire that he did to be Kaido is hell in two years. Because I, Oh yeah, Twitch. I get. I'll, 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 I will get to that soon enough. I will. I will. Absolutely. So. Okay. Uh, uh, Quantum pineapple. Zoro versus uh, Luchi fight will be great gauge to gap between Zoro versus Luffy. By the way, if Zoro struggles versus Luchi, it'll show how vast difference is. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. Basically, yeah, that's all I'm saying. I think that. Man, I don't know. I think that. The gap could be bigger than, lot, than what a lot of folks want it to be. A lot of Zoro fans want it to be. I'll tell you that. Uh, Google. Oh, Google me. Go Google me. I got you. Garp's Blue Hole, Kaido's First Thunder Bagua, L Gear 5 Luffy's Punch to Kaido's Head. Not all Kagakaki attacks have gaps to indicate their uh, advanced Kagakaki attacks. I mean, yeah, fair. That's true. No, no, no. Yeah. 
that's not even a two. I think that it is based on just the lighting both themselves. But yeah, you're absolutely correct. You are correct. I think the gaps kind of come... Because Kaido, I think, was coding himself constantly with Congress hockey, but at the same time, again, it's not it's not consistent with Oda. With Oda, it's there, it's not there. But yeah, you're right. Uh, Taurus, much love for the $2, much love for the $2, Taurus. Appreciate you. GDN, uh, $2. Lamal, Zoro fans are wanking Luchi over Kizarik. Yeah, I know. That, that, that's probably... That, that's when I just, like... I, I don't know. <laughs> Again, it's going to be, we have to wait and see how this fight goes on. But I can, if, if Zoro has to go like full power, Ashra, the king of hell, dead man's game, one miss silver against Luchi, hybrid, like awaken ancestral playing leopard bullshit. It's like, yeah, okay, come on. Like, Luffy won Don Rocket. Uh, Joe Music. Ready for One Piece Live Action King? Yeah, we'll stream that tomorrow on Patreon. I'll, we'll have to wait and see how much... I'm going to get to everything in one, in one stream, but I'll try to get to as much as I can. Alejandro, saying Kizar is at the same level as Green Bulls, like saying Jack is as strong as Katakuri, just because they're both Yonko commanders. Um, No, I don't think so. I think that... Because we know, based on... And this is where things kind of differ here, too. We have to assume that Kizar is stronger because of just, like... Well, maybe not assume, but it's a safe assumption, I should say, because based on Kizaru's tenure, there is no, ev there was evidence to, to suggest that Katakuri was over Jack, just narrowly speaking, because the equal to Jack the Drought in Wano Country was Pero Sparrow. Not even, not even a sweet commander. It was Pero Sparrow, Pero Perrine. Right now, there is nothing like that for Green Bull and Kizaru. Nothing, not a single thing. But that I think is still a safe assumption, nonetheless. But I don't think it's like, oh, the gap is massive. No. Uh, 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 uh. Like I think I have Green Bull in my top fifteen, and Kizaru is like uh, he's the beginning of my top ten. I think that's what I had last time. Uh, who fights Saturn? I have no idea. Honestly, here's the thing. If, oh man, if Saturn gets captured by Laffy and Katarina, stocks are down all across the spectrum for the Gorosei. I mean, they take it, they, they, they nosedive. Nosedive, man. Oh. Uh, Prince of the Monsters. Luchi would have more of an equal fight against Sanji. Uh, maybe. Let me see. Uh, Tono Anavir. Zoro loses to Luchi in the final saga. <laughs> nah, stop. Uh,. It's fumbles over here. Five. What would probably shock the world if is Luffy is if Luffy has three hostages, Vega Punk, Kizaru, and Saturn? To the same uh, It feels like the biggest shock is gonna be coming from Luffy's point of view or like Luffy's camp. I don't think it's gonna be it. Nah. Having three hostages, quote unquote? Kizaru and I don't think why would they want to have Kizaru as a hostage? I don't see why. Nah. I don't see why. Saturn? Nah. But that'll be Blackbeard though? Yeah. I can see Blackbeard doing that via Laffy and Katarina, but I don't see Luffy doing that for Saturn. No. House of the day. Yo, Cole. How are you disrespecting Flamingo like that? That guy was uh study <laughs> that guy was studly and 1v9 the whole island. He is for sure animal level. Uh get out. No. 1v9 the whole island? No. Hold on. The the, the problem is that if he was as powerful as I say he was. Why would then the Yonko feel the need to send Jack the Drought and Cracker to deal with Luffy and try and save Doflamingo? <laughs> nah, dude. Like, Dofi's great, don't get me wrong. Like, he's cool as hell, but nah. Nah. Like, I give Dofi Yonko Commander 2 status just because I'm being, like, generous to his versatility and ability. That's it. That's, that's really it. Um... But a lot of the poor trail goes against what you're saying. Daniel, five. Play the new Won't Be Slave Action trailer. Luffy says, oh, I can't wait to see the look on your face when we, uh, fuck it, what? Mm. Well, I don't think you play it on YouTube because YouTube, I think, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get copyright claim. And I don't want to do that. It's annoying. Um, but I'll probably watch that when I do my stream later tonight. Though, I don't see... Do I have to do... Maybe I should do that, I guess, but it feels like redundant now because it's coming out tomorrow. But I guess to post it on YouTube, I guess I could do that. Uh, Shinkai, if they shake... If they take... Uh, if they take... 
Oh, I mean Shockies. Okay, if they take Shocky Luffy statements as literal, that means that the Monster Trio is at O'Reilly level. Shocky said boys and plural. Luffy is above them, so that makes no sense. Luffy over Rayleigh. Um, if it's more literal, yeah. I mean, I I, I think that eventually they have to be stronger than O'Reilly. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I, yeah, I'll see even now they're probably stronger, stronger than O'Reilly. Yeah, I'll see that. Sure, why not? I mean, because well, I mean, I guess you can argue that maybe O'Reilly is like ahead of the first commanders, maybe because Garp is. And they're probably parallel in some ways, but I'm not too sure. Hmm. Let's see on the same level. Fuck it. Why not? So, just lol, don't let them distract you all from the fact that until recently, Cole thought three atoms equals one Yonko. Lamau. Listen, dude. Like I said before, and I'm saying it like, it, it depends on the Yonko. Not all Yonko are the same in power. I put Kaido over Big Mom back in the day, though I think currently she, she could be over Kaido. She gets that buff uh, for Elbath. That's what I'm hoping. That's what I'm hoping for. I think that Whitebeard was the weakest Yonko going into Marine Four at that point in time. Old, um, bad health, uh, old age, sick. Well, that's the same thing. Uh, old age and bad health, basically. Um, I think that Shanks is the premier Yonko. So I would say that in order to beat Whitebeard, it'll take like two admirals back then yeah when he was at full hp not stabbed through the chest by squardo <laughs> um and not having heart attacks mid-battle you know what i'm saying jesus christ dude Oda went through hell and high water to nerf one nigga it was crazy um and he's still almost two piece to kainu you fucking <laughs> Green Bull said that he wouldn't even want to dare set foot in Wano country if Kaido was around. I'm like, I ain't doing that shit, big boy. Fuck no. And then Big Mom and Kaido are comparable in some ways because they fought each other for an entire damn day. And Shanks is God King. I mean, shit. Just in the presence of Shanks' hockey, Green Bull. I mean, I don't know what else I have to fucking say. Like, these ain't... The Admirals aren't Yonko. The bounty itself would some not... That... <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Um... Like, how many more... How much more evidence does Oda need to show you guys? And again, when I say Yonko, I mean, like, the old Yonko. So I'm talking about the guy who saw in the pre-time skip. Um, that... Pantheon of Yonkos, uh, the strongest one, Whitebeard, Shanks, Big Mom, Kaido. Uh, Scotty, Zoro, low diff, uh, low diff, Lucci, no, I'm going to see. And then Swaggin, Detail Defender, Cam for this week's episode 10, true, that should be going too. That should be, that should be, oof. That should be, because those trailers, those look so, they look like some damn good trailers, some damn good trailers, some damn good trailers. All right. And that's it. Hold on. Algaji and Kizaru attacked Shanks, baby boy, and he and his crew did nothing but pray. Um, Algaji attacked, attacked Shanks and the uh, boy. Well, I mean, that was before Kizaru. I mean, that, you know, that was after Kizaru decided to stop. If Kizaru didn't stop, they would have killed him and his crew. Keep that in mind, right? <laughs> Keep that in mind. One pistol is all he needed. If he actually kept on fighting, they would have killed Luffy Company, but they didn't. It is what it is. Like, it, 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 it's super, 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 super simple. The vast majority of the evidence points to the Yonko being way more pa powerful. 
pow more powerful than the admirals. And some Yonko, way more powerful than admirals. That's what the vast majority of the evidence points at, undeniably. Whether it's the new bounty thing, whether it's the actual feats of Yonko just shaking admirals, whether it's in movies or in canon, doesn't matter, it's still there. Um, whether it's Admiral's own statements of, oh, I don't want to be here if fucking um, uh, Kyro's here. Whether it's uh, more feats of Admiral's getting damn near two-shotted by a two attacks. Like, the vast majority of the evidence is like, Yonkos are them. And the Admiral's are great, but they're not them. All right. Uh, it's Scooty, not Scotty. Fair enough, fine. Yes, Zoro loaded Fuji. All right. Fair enough. Let's, let's wait and see. Uh, as folks said, he's sweating. I'm seeing one, two, two beads of sweat on Zoro's uh, forehead. We have to wait and see. Uh, we, uh, we have to wait and see. We have to, just, we have to wait and see. We have to wait and see. All right. So, on that note, on that note, that's it. I'm going on YouTube to see you guys later. Because now I get into Twitch stuff for like a little bit. Well, no, no tier three. But I, I need to go through all these Twitch donos and give Twitch their love and their time. So, YouTube, I'm going to see you guys on the fleeps. Admiral stopped Wipeyear and murked his crew. You do realize that Wipeyear came to this whole battle with a stab wound going through his chest out his back, right? This man had heart attacks mid-battle. You do understand that, right? You, 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 you do realize that Wipeyear was already old and sick, and then he gets like a fucking mortal wound to his chest. Huh? What the fuck are you? God, I, niggas have to reread shit. That being said, yep, got you for the stream, no doubt about that. Okay, I, I plan on doing a stream on Friday talking about the chapter and the live action with the tier three cats, of course, any other YouTubers I want to pull up, all that stuff, and we'll talk about all these, all this One Piece content. Because uh, I want to do more streams. <sighs> I need to have, I'm still having a hard time juggling doing video creation and streaming. It's very hard to do that, I have to say, it really is. But I'm, I'm going to find a way. I'm going to find a way. First 10 seconds of the trailer only. Daniel, fuck, just go to Twitch, all right? I, I can't watch it now because I don't, I don't, I don't want to get any strikes on YouTube. So to be fair, you know what? Hold on, fuck it. Oh, yeah. You know what? Since you're so fucking persistent. It's like, ah! Okay. I'm just fucking... Mm -hmm. This one, 10 hours ago, I'm assuming? I'm gonna find the One Piece. It's called Roger's treasure. He hid it somewhere in the Grand Line. It's a myth. Can't wait to see the look on your face when we find it. Okay. <laughs> I'm scared. Listen, Twitch don't give a damn. So niggas are comfortable there. But on YouTube, it's an iron fucking fist. Daniel, I got you. Okay, you happy now, Daniel? I'm scared. All right. Uh, don't don't tell him to react harder because I got. I just gave it to you. All right. So that's it. Big Mom is the young. Okay, so, on that note, Rose over Lucci, true. <laughs> true, true. All right, everyone, that's it. I got you, Daniel. I got you. I got you. I, I get what you wanted. All right, much love for the donut. I appreciate you. All right, on YouTube, I'm going to see you guys later. Young Co over Admirals. Even a future Buggy, because Buggy's going to twicken his Conqueror's Hockey and his Duff Food at the same time. He's going to come out like fucking Moses, and he's going to chop the whole sea. Looking Stud Lee. I'm going to see you cats on the flip side. Be easy. On YouTube. Be easy. <laughs> oh, my.